Uh, just taking down camp. It's day seven. Day seven. Taking camp down. And we're about... <laughs> I think we're still running. We're running about 12 hour days. Yeah, 12, 13 hour days. Let's go over here and see what we're having for breakfast. And Kelly, what are we having today for breakfast? Today we're having migas! Okay, what's a miga? <laughs> Corn tortillas. Okay. Scrambled eggs. Some sauteed green peppers and onions topped with cheese, tomatoes, and avocado. Like nachos. It's basically nachos. breakfast nachos. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. okay. Just gonna make come, it. You gotta come see it once, like, it's all laid out. Oh, you mix it all together. Okay. <coughs> we'll be back. There <laughs> we go. It's, uh, I don't know what time it is. Does anybody know what time it is? Breakfast time. Yeah. 6.24. 6.24. <laughs> okay, and uh, we're back. She said to come back. So now I'm working with um, a factory that makes all of the Oh, yesterday after dinner I played a game of triominoes and kicked butt. Of course, I have to camp help because I had no idea what I was doing, but that's pretty fun. <laughs> all right, can I go eat some breakfast and get packed up? And this is the finished product. We got Migas! <laughs> Looks, it actually looks good. What's it? Amigas? Migas. Migas. Yep. Okay. Cool. Time to eat. And there's now our empty camp spot. And there's our lovely sun. Days get hot here. I don't even know what day it is. I know it's something like May 2nd or 3rd, something like that. But. It already gets brutal during the day. <laughs> Breakfast nachos. Time to eat. We're blinking. So okay. All right, yeah, see you down below. We had a good run. Yay! Hi, friends. And I'm blinking, and you're blinking. And I'm blinking. We're recording. Okay.
We're here in the Grand Canyons. We just did a short little hike after running Lava Falls and we are looking at some pitch graphs that the Native Americans had done years ago. And they are still sitting here. These are the amazing little finds that you can find here in the Grand Canyon that you really can't find in a lot of places. And if you're coming to visit the Grand Canyon, this is the one place that you can find them. But to get here, you need to get here by river to be able to find these little hidden gems in the canyon. Here's our boat we just pulled in, uh, finished Lava Falls uh, about five miles ago or something. They just pulled in to go up to see some petroglyphs up there. Somewhere up there. I stayed here and put some fleece on because that was cold shit. Seven lunch just pulled in.
Day seven at camp. This is our camp right here. I'll start from the back and we'll head towards the kitchen because we're as, almost as far back as you can go. It's a really, this one's really dispersed. So here we are set up, stuff drying. Tomorrow we make it to Diamond Creek, which is our takeout point. Eight days, 220 six miles I believe it is maybe 228 so I'm walking backwards here so we'll scan around here there's uh, some there and we'll just scan around here got some more back over there over here no cramped the neighbors tonight that's for sure this place is big go all the way out over here uh, looks like we're drying some clothes up there in the trees and that's our camp right underneath that tree It's super windy today when we got here. It's funny when you get off the boat People just run. I mean literally run looking for campsite trying to find the best one <laughs> It's the same way when you get on the boat too When they tell you you can go ahead and board I was getting on yesterday And we're booking it because we want this particular seat that we always get or try to get and uh there's this lady next to me and she freaking takes off running. She goes, so the race is on, huh? <laughs> Luckily she stumbled and I got the seat. <laughs> but yeah, racing onto the boat and then racing to find a camp spot. That is crazy. That's when all rules are out the window and you just, <laughs> you, it's on. So here's some more. Like I said, we're the furthest back you can get. Then we kind of come here. This is kind of the central hangout, even though it's not the kitchen. They got two kind of different beaches here, so this is like hangout. And 
There's another one here. Oop, got another one hanging out over there. And here's the other group getting ready. Tonight, I, we're having steak and potatoes since their last night. I'm not sure what kind of steak, so maybe we'll find out when we get over to the kitchen. Here's some more hanging out. Here's our river. Here's our boat. This guy's got the whole beast all to himself except a bunch of noisy neighbors. And also notice everybody's wearing the, these little cat ear things. That kind of seems to be the deal. This is a moment of sermon. This major danger face the I'm just showing everybody these funky ass ears thing that we're wearing. Happy birthday, Rob. Happy birthday, Rob. Uh oh, somebody's birthday. <laughs> <laughs> and we're all the way in that underneath that tree right there. So this is where they're hanging out. And then again, there's the boat. And then you did this other trail here that actually goes to the kitchen. So we had to carry that stuff. Oh, there's actually, a, which is kind of inconvenient, there's actually a groover right through there. So we come through this trail here, and then here we have the kitchen. Oh, and here's the whole crew, and they got their funky ass ears on too. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ian and <Hi>. Teresa. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> but, and there is Kelly. <laughs> And there's Chad, and I'm sure Chad is probably still lost. He was lost Who twice. Yet. Are we? See, I told you, that's our guide. He still don't know where we're at. He just knows there's water there. And then there is Wes cooking up the steaks. Oh, he's got his ears on too. And Wes, what kind of steaks are we having? Uh, we've got some ribeyes and some strips. Oh, ribeyes and some strips. And for dessert? Big cookie. <laughs> it's everyone's favorite. All right. All Sounds good. And this is day seven. Anybody know what the date is? May what? May 4th. Thank you. I don't even know what the May 4th, the day May seven. Be with you. <laughs> All right, so we're going to go hang out, socialize with them, and our tent's almost all set up. Tomorrow we head down river and pack up and get on the bus for I think about a three hour ride. Something like that back at the hotel. Been a crazy freaking time. I hope all this shit turns out because these are both brand new cameras. Only been played with them for like five, ten minutes to make sure they worked. <laughs> Alright, here we go.